We're starting up here, way above middle C. It's two octaves. Actually, middle C is here. This is the next C above middle C. And this is the D and the F sharp above uh, middle C, up here. So you're going to play this in the left hand. D, F sharp for the first measure. C, E for the second measure. And hold it. B, D for the third measure. B flat D for the fourth measure. So hold that. The right hand is going to go like this. So it's A, D, F sharp, G. A, D, F sharp, G, F sharp, G. We're just rolling over these four notes. One more time. We move down to this, this C and the E in the left. That's G, E. G, E, G, E, D, G, D. So here's what we have. Move down to the B and the D in the right hand and play exactly the same thing you just played in the right hand. I know there are different versions of this and he usually plays this differently each time, but this is a good way to start. Now come down to the B flat D. One more time. That's F, E, F, E, D, F, D. So here's what we have again, up here. We move down one octave to the same notes we were on up above, up here in the left hand. This is middle C. We're right here at D and F sharp again. It's very similar to the first part, but it goes like this. Same left hand, but right hand. D, A. F sharp, G, F sharp, D, A, A. Now we move down to the same C, E, but at this, at, at before where we were playing the left, left hand, we waited a half a beat quarter beat in this case. Now we go right on the beat. And again, we play this differently every time, but this is the way to do it. A, G, F sharp, E, A, 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 D. Right on the beat when you play them together. Here's what we have so far in this part. Now the next part, a little bit easier. B, D, of course, in the left hand. G, F sharp, D, G, and it repeats. Right on the B. Next part. B flat D in the left, just like before. D, C, B flat A, uh, F. And hold it before you go. 
E D E. So this part. <laughs> so without seeing this part, I'll show you the whole thing again. Now we come down to the next part, down lower. This part goes like this. We're down here now. This, of course, is middle C. You're going to be playing F sharp. D, A in the right, with an F sharp octave in the left. It's this F sharp, and the one you can't see, this way. F sharp, D, A, F sharp octave in the left hand. And do it like this. I'm alternating the whole chord with the A. up to a G octave in the left down here, and F sharp D B in the right. Same pattern. Chord and then the thumb. Then it goes G F sharp E D. So here's what we have on this part. we repeat the same rhythmic pattern up here. Oops, excuse me. <laughs> A in the left hand, A natural, F sharp D A in the right. Again. Now we move to a G with a B in the left, B octave in the left, G D B in the right. So, now we move to an A, C sharp, E, with a C sharp in the left, same rhythmic pattern. Again. Now we come down to a G, G, B, D in the right, B in the left. Just play these without the thumb uh, alternating. Then we come all the way down here. And you play it fairly softly if you can see it. There's a D. I'm playing a D that you can't see. The last two D's on the keyboard down here. But we're going to play it with a D, F sharp, A, D in the right. And it's fairly soft there. So here's what we have on this part again. And then we finish off with... Again, you're just breaking up this D chord. D, F sharp, A, D. down to here. You're going to play just a single C sharp with the left and a D and an A with the right. To a B in the left with a D and a G in the right. So again, C sharp D A in the uh, together to a B, D, G, back to the same D chord you just played. You can even do that if you want. That's the intro.